Orkan, a 37-year-old foal. The theme of this video is old age. Can blood stem cells give a better quality of life in old age? In the video, Orkan is 37 years old, shiny coat, good muscles and without shoes, trots and gallops like a much younger horse. These are the woes of his owner. Two years have passed since the day, the 23rd of August 2006, that Dr. Polatini and I made the first blood stem cell injection. Since then, many things have changed. The first injection was made after the horse, 35 years old, suffered another physical collapse due to the hot summer. This physical exhaustion was due to the fact that, because of his considerable age, the peripheral nervous system was beginning to break down, so much so that Orkin had visible difficulties walking from a standstill, and you can see him staggering slightly, a little unsure, then, then a minute later walking well and evenly. He had difficulty getting to his feet due to probable pain in his rear legs. His thyroid appeared swollen and maybe because of this he stayed away from his group. After giving the first intravenous stem cell injection, things seemed to have changed a lot. In fact, two days later Orkin began to go into the field happily and played with the group horses that were half his age and very fit due to daily training. You can clearly see a renewed confidence in himself and his old joy has reappeared. I was so happy I couldn't control myself watching the horse with which I had shared the most part of my life. Being reborn at 35 and I thought this was the maximum, but I was wrong. Together with Dr. Polatini, we decided to repeat the stem cells every spring so that with the arrival of the hot summer, the horse would be prepared. Therefore, in May 2007, we repeated the protocol. That summer, Orkin had no problems and he seems to be improving daily. The thyroid that was visibly swollen improved immediately after the first stem cell injection of 2006 and now he's stable regardless of the weather. The peripheral nervous system. From 2006 to now, Orkin continues to improve. Now when he gets to his feet from lying down or when he begins walking from standstill, there is no more staggering. He walks sure-footedly and sometimes he escapes into the woods. When he lies down, either in his stable or in the field, he stands up well. One day while I was cleaning him, I saw that he spat out a kind of stone. I was immediately worried. I picked it up, hoping it was not a tooth. It took me a while to realize that what I had in my hand was tartar. I checked his mouth well and realized that the tartar was falling off his teeth, just like a plaster cast. Fantastic! Two years later, I was able to verify that besides the immediate improvement following the injection, there was a continual improvement over time. As if, initially, the horse's problem was resolved, but more importantly, the stem cells slowly reset the cause of the original problem that are often unmanifested. Unfortunately, Orkan died of colic at 38 years old, leaving Sylvia, her broken, having lived with him for 34 years. Since then, I have changed my protocol regarding old horses. I now give them more stem cells injection per year, and I also use allogenic ones. doesn't show his age. He is fighting fit, 
You cannot believe he is 37 years old. It is like watching a physically fit 100 year old jogging. Let's say that in this case the environment was of great help. The care and the love of the owner. The fact he was born in a special microclimate for horses. In fact, two miles as the crow flies from where he lives. Two super stallions from last century, Niarco and Ribot, were born. So I ask you, how important will this therapy be for old age? I invite you to look at my YouTube video, Blood Stem Cells, How and Why They Work. Here you'll find many answers. Thank you.